moment I wake up. Yeah. We're back on this Tuesday with today's beauty and tips from the woman who helps Meredith Vieira put on her best face every morning, and it's a beautiful face. It certainly is. Eve Pearl is a five-time Emmy award-winning makeup artist and the author of Plastic Surgery, without surgery, <laughs> but uh, most important to us, Eve is a part of our Today Show team, and she is here to share some secrets from a professional makeup artist. Hello. Hi, sweetie. Hi, nice to see she you. She just opened this gorgeous place. Yes, yes we you love your store. So cool. Thank you. Now, one of the big problems most of us have, I think, when getting started is the basics. It's the foundation and the concealer and getting that whole palette right. I'm so amazed how many women don't know how to match the foundation to their face. Skin type. And because everyone wants to match it to the back of their hands. Yeah. Well, the back of your hand is not your face. It's yeah. not the same yeah. color. So what should we do? That's why we're doing this Makeup 101. We're going to just teach the basics. Okay. Foundation and concealer. We have three beautiful models with us Yeah, and the real women. So let's take a look at our first model before. This is the before picture of Sammy. Okay, what, what are her issues? And here's Sammy. She is adorable, but she has a very sensitive skin that's acne prone, and I also suffered from this. Okay. And you know what? It's very, very easy to cover up. Um, All right, to, so this is Sammy now, and wow. you have done half of her face with a, with a concealer, right? So half of her yeah. face is done with the foundation. Now, let me show you. This is a dual foundation. This is uh -huh. the HD foundation. Usually, we've been told to use the light color in the T-zone. Now, look at this, ladies. I'm actually going to take the darker color, the darker color Where of the two, yeah. and I'm putting it right here in the red. Okay. It will completely get rid of the red instead of having it turn chalky. Uh -huh. I'm going to use the lightest color down here. And by the way, this is how you match the foundation oh. to your skin. You put the color down here, the lightest color. You uh -huh. wet a sponge. Wet and it. You, wet it. You wet it because don't, you feel how don't it is. Don't use spit. It's, use don't, nice water. Well, if you yeah. have nothing else, then if you have to use spit, but I'd, we'd rather not on someone else. The lightest color. If you put the lightest color down here, you see how it'll match nicely with your neck. So basically, if you're using the darker color right here, you're doing, on the cheek you're doing two on the things. Chin. You're actually contouring your face also. And down here, it'll get rid of all the redness. Then, of course, you're you, using your own line, which is absolutely gorgeous, which well, helps too. Thank you. This is the Eve Pearl brand. But if you don't have access to Eve Pearl, you can use CoverGirl, you can use Sephora. It's available on the internet, I understand. Yes, yes now, it is. Eve, the, the concealer, I always have trouble. You always think it should be lighter. And should it be? That or? is a very, very good question, Hoda. We all have been told to use yes. a lighter color concealer. Right. Well, ladies, what we have is, this is a salmon color concealer. You see how much, it looks a little bit darker, but let's, this is what happens. When you use a salmon color concealer, it actually neutralizes the blue veins that are coming out under your eyes, and it smooths everything out. Now, about powder, now yeah. we have to actually set the face here with powder, and sometimes okay. you can use your blush as powder. Hello. So yes, use a little, I didn't pink, know that. a little peach, and you can set your face with the blush, it serves as powder. If you don't All want right. that cakey look. If you look. don't want right. the cakey, yeah. let's move on. We've got to come do down it. here. Let's, let's go to our next wonderful model. Oh, this is Lessa. Oh, wait, 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 don't That's look at her. Okay, okay let's look, look at the before picture. Don't look. Don't look. Okay, this is Letha before. <laughs> and Letha, All right. Now, Letha also, I feel, is gorgeous, but she she's Indian. And, you know, it's Let's very hard for Indian women yeah. to find makeup that matches. And she's got a lot of blue that but comes out. Right. And she is gorgeous. Wow. And the same thing. What happens with Letha when she puts foundation, sometimes it gets very, very ashy looking and very chalky. So, ladies, what again, we you? have a darker and a lighter. So, look what we're going to do. We're going to take the darker color and, and put, put it on. right here. And that's going to get rid of all the redness right on the nose and also on on the chin, you see, wherever she has the acne blemish, it takes that right away. The lightest color, I'm going to put on the jaw. right on the jaw. And look, can you see her cheekbones developing? Look at, look at, well, please. Look How at those got cheekbones. Got she's she's, she's anyway. gorgeous. Hello. Kind of the annoying. sponge <laughs> is wet, right? So we wet the sponge. We mix everything in. We do under the eyes. Okay, so what are we going to use under her eye? What color? Salmon. Salmon, Salmon color Salmon. under the eyes. So look at how dark it is. Think lunch now, under your eye. At we, all we love our food. Now, okay. not only will this work under her eyes, watch why I blend it and use the same sponge. And if you notice, I'm doing the concealer last, not first. Not because first. if you start out with a concealer, by the time you put on your foundation, huh. you've wiped it off. Now watch. The under eye looks smooth. The same salmon, you see where she has the blue yeah. by her lips? I'm going to put it anywhere she might have the blue that comes out, and that will completely eliminate that. We have less than a wow. minute. we got okay. to get to our last model. Okay, wait. Don't, don't look at her. Don't. Okay, let's do the before picture of this final model. Okay. Okay. 
Oh, and here oh, we hi. have Grace. <laughs> now Grace has, she hi, Grace. goes, this, you know, most of us have a lot of redness in our face. You see, we have a lot of redness and the rest of our body is yeah. not so red. So of course we want to even out our skin tone. So the way you even out the redness is you don't want to use something too light. This works the same way for when you have a sunburn. Remember, Hoda, when you have a sunburn, what yes, you do? Yes, I remember. You what? don't put a light color because it's going to uh -huh. turn chalky. You want to have a darker, darker color. Darker. You want to have a lighter color, so it's going to match your neck. And ladies, look in your own uh, makeup yeah. counters. I'm sure you have some products that you can find. That's Where's the salmon? The Eat. salmon, the salmon. Okay, and if you <laughs> don't have time Eat to do the it alone, getting hungry. Uh -huh. Now watch, look at the salmon. Even though yeah. I didn't blend it in yet, we're going yeah. to do the salmon right here. Yeah. Even look how dark it is, but it is going to work. Eve, watch it's brilliant. how even it's going to be. Your products are absolutely oh, dewy. They're absolutely oh, so beautiful. Yeah. I learned something, didn't yeah. you? Yes. The yes. lighter in the jawline, the darker on the cheeks, and the salmon. So this is the first step. If you get this right, ladies, we'll come back and do some eye makeup. We'd love that. Okay. Thanks, Eve. Thank you so much, lady. Guess who's coming up? Padma. Yeah, she's in the kitchen. She's got a lot to talk about after this.